And today I want to talk to you about something that I've been applying in my life every day that has been so powerful for me. And I think it would be powerful for you too. Um, and of course I'm speaking for myself here. But if anything fits for you, then great. Then that's great. So um, one of the things that I've been um, going through or struggling with uh, is the aspect of eating very fast. I don't know if you deal with that too, but I, I've dealt with eating. When, when, I, when I'm eating very fast, in my mind, it's a binge. When I eat very quickly, I all of a sudden go to binge and I'm checked out completely. I'm completely checked out. Um, how often does that happen? Not that often. Why? Because I have um, been using a method uh, that's been working for me for, for some time now. The method that I use um, is to obviously bring the, the unconscious mind to the conscious mind. That's the biggest piece is, is bringing about awareness in the moment. And the way that I do that is, is really simple. Um, two things. Scarcity that I've been using, uh, scarcity versus abundance. It's about being conscious and understanding, I've been understanding that if I'm in the scarcity mode of there's never gonna be enough and my ego is driving that and I'm, and I'm feeling that energy and I'm in that energy state of mind, right? So if I'm there, then therefore I'm gonna keep eating more because I will never think there is enough and that's what's creating the binge. So if there's five pieces of pizza, right, you know, what I used to do very often in the past was I'd go for the five pizzas. I, I would literally order five pizzas, piece pieces at a time because I was afraid that it, there was never gonna be enough. I was afraid, I was living in fear and in the scarcity mode, that I had to, I had to order all five because one, one won't be enough, two won't be enough, I know when I order more, so I must order five. And I realized I was living and operating in scarcity and that was driving my binging. And when you're living in abundance, there is enough, there, this is enough, right? <laughs> so. What I've chosen to, to do is, is live, in, live in a place of abundance with uh, having a better relationship with food. So what I do now is if I'm gonna go order pizza, okay, I'll go order one piece of pizza. And my mind, the mindset, the beliefs are telling me, order five, order five, like there's not gonna be enough, there's not gonna be enough. And I'm like, like shut the hell up, shut the hell up. Like it's it's like the narration is literally in my head because that's not necessarily gonna go away. It's now I'm conscious of, you know what, what I need to do now is just simply order one, sit down, eat it, slow down, chew the food, and boom, voila. If I want more, sit, talk to myself, you know what? have more it's not that I'm restricting and saying I can't have five I'm just saying in the in the moment living in abundance is having one one is enough at the moment and if I want another one what I do is I'll go up to the, the cashier and I say I want another one and I allow myself to if I allow myself to have two sit back down and I say to myself okay you know what I want more I want to I want to continue binging right in my mind I'm telling myself it's a binge or I could but it's really not because I'm living in abundance. I'm not living in scarcity where I have to have three or four or five or six or scarf it down as fast as I can. I'm enjoying that one piece. And if I want more, I go up and get more. So this is a revelation I've been having um, and been living in for quite a while now. And I wanna share it with you because it's probably the most single powerful thing that I have ever done um, and ever have accomplished um, and ever successfully sustained doing. Okay, if if you're willing, okay, and it, it even goes down to deeper than willingness. Willingness is is kind of automatically there. It's kind of automatically there for me, but it's more of the place of um, the place of gr a growth of living. Do I want to live in you know understanding? Okay, now I get I, I now I get scarcity. I've been living in in fear and scarce that this is this will I'll never be able to eat uh, unhealthy again. That's the scarcity place, but no, you can't have a balance with food and a relationship with food, a good, loving, healthy relationship with food if you're in scarce mode. Just like a relationship. It's no different than all parts of my life, our life. Uh, but in this case, it's just 
uh, obviously my relationship with food. So I've chosen to live that way and it is unbelievable what can happen when you just live in abundance. One is enough and then maybe two, maybe you want three, you allow yourself three, you want four, allow yourself four. So hope this was helpful, comment below. You guys are awesome. I miss posting this group here, so it's good good to talk to you guys again. Always private message me if you have a question. Post below if you got a question. I'm here to support, I'm here to love. I'm here to give back from the gifts and gold that I, I've been given over the years uh, with, with my own struggles of overcoming, not overcoming, uh, connecting and, and embracing. I don't like the word overcoming. Embracing the, uh, the food uh, things that I had a problem with. Okay, bye.